Hey guys, thank you so much for tuning into my channel. For all my new people, welcome, welcome, welcome. We are here for yet another Browse With Me tour. Today we are inside of our house, which is a home decor and furniture store located in Rockville, Maryland. So we're just going to dive in and get started, prop your feet up, get you some popcorn, and let's go. So as you can see here, we're zooming in on this nice dining set, and then we're going to move along the wall here to look at some pillows really nice neutral color pillows I love the blue blue is one of my favorite colors <laughs> I love tassels I love the trimming around the pillows I love the prints I love those very neutral type of vibe going on here we have this very ornate wall decor item here that we're looking at and then we have like a sideboard or what do you call this like a cabinet I love the vases this on the top of the cabinet, the black, I love that. Very nice. So we're gonna hop on in to some bedroom pieces next. Now I do wanna say this, I did zoom in on prices guys, but some of the signage, the font is not legible because it's so small and I didn't realize it until after the fact. So I did zoom in on what I could. Some of the key elements that stuck out to me throughout this whole entire store was the mirrors and the lighting. And I will definitely link some of the lighting and mirrors below in the description box. Um, like this beautiful pendant lighting here. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I love it. And you're gonna see plenty of them throughout the video. Next, we are in this nice little living room setting here. And let me just say this. A lot of these stores, guys, are full of items like it's so much to look at and i would have to spend like an entire day there just to get every little thing so sometimes i just do a nice little you know <laughs> run through like that <laughs> because i can't get every single nook and cranny a nice beautiful chandelier lighting love it love it love it again another gorgeous mirror here very rustic I love the details of the mirror. So I will say again, I can't get every single nook and cranny because I would have spent the entire day there, but I get as much as possible. This is a nice little bedroom setting. This place underneath the grand staircase that you will see, that you saw in the beginning, and you're gonna see it again. Here, we're gonna look at this beautiful room here, and then we're gonna zero in on the chandelier, of course, but, I do want to say I totally forgot to zoom in on that mirror because I absolutely love that mirror. It looks like a vintage rustic type of mirror. I totally ignored it. And then when I watched the video, I'm like, oh, <laughs> I didn't get that mirror. But anyway, here's another mirror. Dining set here. We're going to zoom in on this price. I think this one you can actually see, see barely. So a lot of the signage is like that. But the stuff that has like t um, hanging tags, I kind of zoomed in on those. Another great pendant light there. I don't know what it is about our house and these pendant lights, but I am loving them. I try to pay attention to key things that stand out, you know, because certain places you go, you like, they're known for this and they're known for that. So what I'm getting is when I'm looking for pendant lighting for my house, I will definitely keep our house in mind another nice mirror it seems like that mirror comes in a few colors right there very nice i will try to link the link that mirror those mirrors in the description box below since i didn't get any information on it this nice chenille i think it's chenille fabric chair i think it's really cute and as you can see you could pick multiple colors of that um some little ottomans little what do they call those things <laughs> little i don't know you can sit on them i know or put your feet up on them. Um, here we are. I love those lamps. So the key things I mentioned, guys, like I said, I will have them linked in the description in the description box below. So make sure you go hang out there and check out some of the pieces. Also, the link to the entire store will be there. Also, a nice little bedroom setting here. I really wish they would have put like some type of flowers or something in that little basket over there. That would have been cute. I love to get the view of the whole room. You guys should know that by now. I love the architecture detail. You will definitely see me check that out throughout this entire video. So here we are just looking at some nice things here. 
and we're gonna move along to this mirror guys you will see throughout the video too because it comes in it also comes in other colors I will link it below and we have another dining set here we're going to take a look at with some nice rattan it looks like those chairs are rattan guys I'm not sure the weaving mm, see I got that that showed up pretty clear and then we have some tags hanging Luciano and if you take a look, I love to show the entire view of the rooms. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Then we're gonna look at some of these little, I don't know if you call them knickknacks or things that you can decorate with. Let's just say that, <laughs> decor. <laughs> love these items here. We have the little doves and the little birds and everything like that. So, and then the little um, baskets on the wall, I thought those were cute too, along with some candles. Nice little traditional seating here. More lighting, like a floor lamp. That lamp also comes in like a table lamp. Look at this pendant lining, guys. Love this one. It's, you see I zoomed in, right? I love that. It feel like it would give like a nice ambiance. Like you wouldn't use that like for if you need like bright lighting. <clears throat> but it will set the tone of the atmosphere in the room. And I like that. I think it's really nice, the rustic look to it. Pretty cool. I will definitely link that below. Um, here we are. Look at the vases and the dresser. See the table lamps to the floor lamp that I talked about over there. Okay, guys. So I'm going to go pretty quick here. This is an industrial crank glass top table. I thought it was pretty cool. So I just wanted to show you guys this table. And we're moving along here to this nice dining set here. Long table. We're going to check out this chair. Again, I did not sit in any of the um, chairs throughout this video. I, I was not thinking I should have just to test the comfortability, but I did not. But I thought this chair was pretty unique. So I wanted to give you guys a nice look at it. I think it's always a good idea to have a nice row of vases along the dining table like this with a little greenery in them just to bring a nice design element to the table. I like that very simple. Again, some of the signage was not legible because of the font was too small. Next, we're gonna move on over to this room here and we're going to check it out. Nice sectional sofa, great for entertaining a lot of guests or just the family snuggled up watching a nice movie or one of my YouTube videos. <laughs> this nice sweater-like chair I thought was pretty cool. Looks like a throw blanket or a sweater like I said. And I always want to check out the wall decor. Very nice planters up top there. I feel like that would be a nice DIY project to create some of those planters that were up there. And my finger always makes a feature in my videos. Wouldn't be one of my videos if it didn't have my finger. <laughs> and then we're just going to take a look up to the gorgeous dome this in the middle of the ceiling here. You guys know I like to check out the architectural detail throughout the stores. Then we're gonna move on to some outdoor patio furniture. Check out this beautiful rattan wicker chair. You know, rattan is our theme, was our theme for March. It's trickling over a little bit until April, <laughs> but it's okay. So all of this is just some nice patio outdoor furniture here and that's a rocking chair which I didn't notice at first check out the pricing of this sofa and then we're going to take a look at the pricing of the planter which I believe is $999 if I'm not mistaken that's what that price tag says there for that plant And I think that this is like a room divider. Very nice, very tall. I've never seen one that tall before. 
this was a pretty cute patio set, but my favorite was this fire table here. Like, I think it's so nice. Like, I can just picture it now on the patio or in the yard with some chairs or even a sofa around it like this. And the fire just coming up, creating a great atmosphere. I love it. Really, really good idea to turn a table into like a fire pit. So we are just going to move along and we're going to head towards the center of the store in a few so we can head on up these gorgeous steps here. Check out the staircase again. <laughs> See, look how grand that is. I love it, guys. Love the detail. But before we go, we're going to check out this chandelier. I think this one is considered a chandelier. It will be linked below. So we're going to mosey on up these steps here and we're going to head to the left. You guys, this store is huge and I did not realize how huge it was until I got upstairs. I was like, oh, <laughs> so here we're just check, checking, checking out this gorgeous table here. I love the different elements of the wood on it and we're going to check out some of the um, bowls that's sitting on the table. Mm -hmm. So the bowl here is very lightweight. It's like hollow, very light. And they were on sale, so I wanted to show you guys the prices of the bowls. This particular platter, though, was pretty heavy. My hand was shaking when I flipped it over. I was like, oh gosh, please don't let me drop it. <laughs> So yeah, that was pretty heavy. Nice platter. And then we just want to peep the archways. Oh, I'm sorry. Before we peep the archways, check out that rug though. I know I was looking at the price, but look at the rug. Okay. Nice planters for your grand entrance into your beautiful home here. I love these vases. Like the print, like a tribe. I love that. Here we go. Look at the archways. Love it. <laughs> then we're going to check out this table here it reminds me of the dining table sort of like an extension of that so you can tie that into your living room here we have this nice Kipton sofa and my favorite part to check out is the pillows I love pillows and I love to make pillows oh don't forget the pendant lighting <laughs> the pillows here are very very good quality very good quality like I agree with the price I'm like yeah that's about right because they're very good quality very sturdy very durable they won't lose their shape like it's that's what it is loved this lamp not only because it was on sale for 149 but I love the print like it's gorgeous to me Let's check out this room. Again, I told you guys I can't hit every nook and cranny. <laughs> but this beautiful leather chair reminds me of like a director's chair. It's really, really nice and swanky. And this is a nesting coffee table here, which is pretty cool. And we're just going to check out this sofa here. Emery Deep. Again, we're just going to run through. I can't go to every single detail, guys. It's so much in the store. It's huge. Beautiful blow. I mean, blow. <laughs> Beautiful throw blankets, guys. I love these blankets, guys. Very, very cool. I feel like they would keep you warm, but I'm not sure because they were very thin. But I guess because of the material, like the fur but actually keep you warm. And those were 149 and the pillows, oh my gosh, guys. The pillows, which I think are very reasonably priced. They, all of these pillows, I believe were 69. They were, cause I checked them all um, off camera, but this particular one, I, oh gosh, the way it felt was so soft and fluffy guys. And I was very surprised to see that this pillow was only $69, but I guess because it's faux fur and it's not actually, you know, real fur. So I'm guessing that's why, but 
I thought that was a very, very good price, $69 for that pillow. It's a nice size, and the feel is just ridiculous. I wish you guys could feel it. You probably can kind of tell by how my fingers was moving across it. This gorgeous chair here, okay, come through Rattan, come through. <laughs> I saw this chair online recently, and I was like, wait, I've seen this chair somewhere. I couldn't remember until I watched the video, and I'm like, oh, they go the chair. That's where I saw it. So nice. Let's check out Malay. Let's check out the Rattan chairs, $5.99. Beautiful sectional sofa here again. And we are going to approach this bar table with these gorgeous bar stools. And we're going to check out the prices of those. Very sleek, distinguished, nice little bar table. And the chairs just definitely adds so much more to the actual table going to check out the price of that you guys know i love these huge sectionals like this because you can get more people on them <laughs> and this gorgeous table here i love that i you know i, I should have checked to see if that pillow was detachable on that table that would have been cool right here we go with a pendant lighting, a draping bead lighting. Gorgeous. Look at this wicker chair, guys. And we're just going to check out the details in the back of it so you can see how it just kind of has a nice angle to it. And this chair looks very comfy, which you know is like my number one priority <laughs> when it comes to comf um, furniture. I love the comfortability of it. Mm-hmm. Just want you guys to see the price. Talia. Talia is very cute. Now, here, guys, we have rugs. Now, <laughs> this was a struggle, guys, trying to show you all these rugs because they were extremely heavy. So, what I should have done was use my tripod to just record me pulling some of them out because I definitely needed both of my hands to look at these rugs, but I wasn't thinking because I did have my tripod with me, but I just wasn't thinking clearly. But I'm so sorry I could not show you like a lot of the rugs because they were extremely heavy, which is a good thing. And because they were so heavy, I thought they would be like ridiculously priced, but each and every rug, I believe they were about $2.99 if I'm not mistaken or 200 or something like that i'll check and i'll link them below but yeah so these guys are like fabric because like i told you before in a lot of these higher end furniture stores you can select your fabric for your item so this area just have like a lot of fabrics for you to choose from which is always awesome and they also have different wood samples here so you can choose your wood which i think is another awesome element then i just want you guys to peep these clipboards they are so cute it looked like it's just like pieces of wallpaper like wallpaper samples on a clipboard very cute some more fabric here and then we're going to move along here and check out this nice handsome distinguished chair on the end here <laughs> very nice chair you can tell it's comfortable with this nice wing back the name of this table is the tuscany and it looks like those pieces you can make it shorter or long or keep it long like this on the, the leaves on the end of the table there so anyway here we have this chair very comfortable very handsome i love the print and i absolutely love the nail heads going along we know we already discussed that before those details add a touch of elegance to it so I'm really, really feeling that. And then I'll show you guys the back of the chair so you can see the full design of the chair. Again, I'm kicking myself. I'm like, oh, I wish I would have sat in that chair, but I didn't. <laughs> there was a lot to cover, guys, a lot. Okay. The price tag is Portsmouth Dining. Okay, so I, I spied another mirror <laughs> and I showed it. And I basically think that's the same mirror I'm always showing you guys. It's just a different finish on it. 
and then these nice lamps here i'm going to zoom in on the price there were a lot of sale items guys a lot and this other lamp i really like too i think i'm more was a fan of the color like that nice mauve color very cute lamp And then guys, we're gonna take a look at this entryway here into this room. Love the detail of this. I love the detail of that. I had to show you guys. And we are gonna head on and look at this beautiful, you know, I would love to have a bedroom like this, guys, with this much lighting. And then I could have like some type of electronic device that would like lower drapes at night, but I actually would love this much lighting in my bedroom or any room in my house. We're just going to check out this lovely room here. And along this wall, these look like built-ins, but they're not. They're really nice. Great to store things, to decorate, put decorative items on it. Or library books. I mean, not library books, but actual books. <laughs> you can showcase and display items on that. Really nice. And then we're gonna peep this mirror. Look at the view. And then this mirror here, remember we saw the white one downstairs just like it? <clears throat> here it is in a darker shade. And it's on sale for $4.79. And there, I just wanted you guys to see that again. And here we have headboards. We have the regular tufted headboards and the Chanel tufted for the channel tufting, let me say. That's channel tufting headboard. And we're just going to check out some of the bedroom furniture here. Again, the signage was so small. Like the font was so small, I couldn't even. Even when I zoomed in on the, like the other side over there, had the price of everything. And I just, I couldn't because it was too small. Some more outdoor views. Bring it on down. And we're going to peep out this room here. Obviously, we see what stands out in this room, which is this chair over here. Another chair I wish I would have sat in. <laughs> I love this chair. I thought it was so cute, very well made, very unique. It has like, it looks like it's really comfortable, but I wonder if it really is. You know, that's why I'm like, oh, I wish I would have sat down because that could have just been the design element to make it look that way, but it could have been really uncomfortable. But we just going to go with it and say, you know what? This comfortable chair. <laughs> I love to see a nice bench at a long table like this. I think it's good because I'm an eclectic type person. Like, I don't like matchy matchy. So, I love the fact that this has like three different seating options at one table. Like, I like that. I really do. And the trays just add a nice touch to it. Nice velvet tufted bench here. A velvet tufted sofa here. <laughs> you can select your fabric as you can see. Gonna zoom in on that. Check out the price. Again, like our house, they're to me they're high end, but they're not as high end as some of the other furniture stores I've been in. You can find reason reasonably priced items inside of here, but you know it's like a mixture of pricing. So I think that's pretty cool about them. Let's check out this chaise here. It's spacious, it's wide, it's not like a little narrow one. I really like it, looks comfortable. And we're gonna check out the prices. Her name is Audrey. And then we're gonna look at this dresser here. Like I always like to open the drawers to see the depth of the drawers because that's very important for organization purposes and we could just cram a lot of stuff in it. <laughs> I gave it a thumbs up, guys. So, and this color is really nice too. Very neutral color. I like the shiny veneer look to it. I think that's pretty cool. And guys, these lamps here like ridiculous and I'm not even a bling bling type of person but I love those lamps okay and then we have a chandelier right there to match those lamps but we gonna come back and talk about that later okay so we're gonna check out this coffee table right here 
it actually had a sew label on it. Someone purchased it. Already, I love that. Um, I thought this was very unique. I love the, I love this table just as a whole here. And then we have pendant lighting. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. To be honest, I think these may be considered chandeliers. I'm not sure, but we'll see. So here's the side table. So it looks like they didn't want the side table. Look at that chandelier, y'all. How pretty is that? Another Portsmouth chair. And at this point, guys, I was really trying to speed up the show <laughs> because my phone began to die. So I was trying to speed up, but as you can see, you will see like it's impossible for me to speed up in these furniture stores. I love the fabric on this. I think it's very sleek. This chair was really nice, but I really felt like this was a kid's, kid's chair because it was very, very small in person. I don't know if you guys can tell through video, but it was very small and it was sold too. I love the print. You know, I like to get the architecture detail of the store. I don't know what this little thing, that thing is called back there, but we're definitely gonna go take a look at that. So this is me trying to hurry up in the store. <laughs> But things kept catching my eye, like this nice rattan chair we about to look at. Or wicker, I don't know. I guess we could say rattan, but I love the back of the chair. I love the shape. Nice and sleek. And then we're gonna check out the price of the chair. Helmsworth. Mm-hmm. I love this cabinet here, y'all. That print, oh my gosh. Love that Raha. Nice table. I was trying to only show the pieces that were like standing out, but it was kind of hard. <laughs> this pillow is really nice. Really nice print. I love the native print on there what is this 129 and do you guys see all of these little rain boots i thought they were cute and they're actually umbrella stands like that was such a genius idea to make a rain boot umbrella stand they're so cute i'll zoom in a little closer once i come back around but i want to check out this massive display item here with the stained glass i thought it was pretty cool and then we have some nice chairs inside. We have the leather, have some pictures going on. Some look at the stained glass, so nice. I don't know what you call this, guys. Do you guys know? Nice leather seating, and then this print. I love the contrasting pillow um, fabric that they use for the pillow to put in. I thought that was cool. I probably would have went with a different texture, but it's cool because I love contrast. You guys should know that. You hear me talk about it all the time. Now, let's look at this bar cabinet, guys. I thought it was very unique and it was very worth me taking the time to go and examine it, even though my battery was dying. <laughs> so, look at it. It's like recycled iron. So, I thought it was pretty cool. And then we're going to open it up and take a look in it so you guys can get a full view of it very nice okay i did i was like wait did i show the price so it's a recycled iron bar cabinet and i thought this was really really nice the shelving and then you have the little things for your bottles to go in it was very sturdy very solid Piece. Yeah, I like that. I wanted to show you guys. I thought that was cool. See, it's kind of, this I think was like a secretary's desk. Like you can pull that thing down like a desk. But again, my battery was dying. So I didn't have time to go and explore and pull it down and all of that. See, here we are at the umbrella stand. The little rain boots. It was cute. Checking out the architecture again, guys. The design of the, the layout of the actual store. This is me trying to hurry up. 
This, guys, is by far my absolute favorite space in the store. Why? Because it's where the sale items are. Clearance items, sale items. I don't know about y'all, but when I go in a store, like, I love to see that they have, like, a section specifically for clearance or sale. And, like, it makes me so excited to the point the next time I go in this store, I will bypass everything else and I will just go to this particular corner. Do you guys do the same thing? I'm not ashamed. I love to catch a good bargain and a good sale. So I just wanted to come through here and show off the sale section, guys. So you guys know when you go to visit the Our House store in Rockville, Maryland, now you know where to find a sale section. Because there were a lot of pieces that I saw like in the actual showroom i don't know if you call it showroom or not but it, throughout the store let's just say that but i was i saw them also in the sale area so some of the pieces weren't marked for sale when it was on display but when you get back here you'll see some of the pieces that are actually on sale so that was pretty cool i don't know if it's just that but see here we go with this mirror again but this one was marked on sale we saw it for like four or something in that little room we went in so this was marked properly, yeah, $4.79. Check out the green bottles, guys. <laughs> Again, I was moving, kind, of, trying to move kind of quickly back here, guys, because time was running out. Pillows, pillows, pillows. I love the way they displayed these pillows. I thought it was pretty cool. Tassels, love, love, love these linen pillows. These are great for spring. So it's awesome that you can go and pick those up now that they're actually on sale, too. A nice white mirror here. I think it's marked down to like $5.99. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Okay, more pillows. I just wanted to make sure you guys see all of the pillows and everything. They have some all different shapes. The stripes, linen, perfect for spring and summer, guys. I'm telling you, really, really good like a blush pink down there that looks velvet the blush pink but check out these chairs guys i love the green velvet so nice and they're 2.99 love it more chairs i feel like i would want to spray paint those green velvet chairs like instead of the dark espresso wood i might would do a white or something i don't know and then it had rugs look at this natural color rug 2.99 Guys, you know rugs can be really pricey. So I was kind of happy to see that they had rugs that were marked down at a nice sale price, you know, to make them affordable. This area was so tight. I was like trying not to like twist my ankle and fall, but I was determined to get in here <laughs> and get the shot for you guys. Check out all of these lamps. This back here that's on sale. And guys, this is pretty much it. Like this is just the sales area here. <clears throat> and this is pretty much it. We're gonna check out this last pendant lamp right here. It's a floor lamp. And then that's it. We're gonna see a little more architecture detail, guys, because you know I have to get that. See, I have to show you guys that. Thank you so much for bearing with me, <laughs> hanging in there and watching this full video, guys. Make sure you subscribe, you like, and you comment, guys. Share this video, guys. I love you, I love you, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.